And as we were talking about, Broncos training camp starts today. And our coverage continues this morning with our Broncos insider Mike Liss and team president Damani Leach. Good morning. Good morning, guys. How you doing? Yes, here we are at Broncos Park, powered by... Common Spirit. Their Common Spirit. That, that's right. And then, uh, so here we are. And Damani, uh, I'm a little surprised, given the construction you're going to do, yeah that uh, there's even a training camp this year for the fans. Yeah, you know, as, as we originally planned, we were we were going to have to start construction a, about a month or so ago. But as we got further into the design process, working with Arapahoe County on our permitting, who've been great from a communication standpoint, we felt like we could still meet our goal of being in a new facility by June of 2026 and have another pra uh, uh, training camp with fans on the berm. So really important for us, obviously, for fans to be able to come out here and experience this. Give us a summary of what this place is going to look like when it opens in 2026. Yeah, so really that berm where uh -huh. the fans sit today, that'll effectively be the new practice facility. It'll be connected to the indoor practice facility, two and a half levels. It'll be it'll be beautiful. And then the idea is then once we move over there, yeah. then we, we demolish this, build a new berm back up, and fans come in and watch practice. Okay, and next year, real quick, uh, any you know what it'll – happen next year next year we'll likely have temporary seating right out here in this parking lot so okay. folks like myself will have to find somewhere else to park okay um and we'll build some temporary seating and stands and fans will be able to watch from there you've been busy uh the marketing department business department new uniforms yeah. uh anything about uh, the one thing that really jumps out to everyone is those throwbacks yeah. Uh, with uh, Randy Gratishar, Steve Foley, yeah. Riley Odoms, yeah. any chance uh, that Raider game uh, is when the throwbacks get broken out? We're all we're all a big fan of the throwbacks and, and definitely look to, to wear them, if not once, uh, twice this season. So we're working on that schedule um, with Coach um, and probably have that released sometime here in the next uh, week or so. Okay. Well, what's the vibe in the building? You know, I know uh, football and business are – are somewhat separated, but yeah. they also bleed together a little bit. You caught up in the excitement here? Yeah, yeah. You know, I mean, I, I sit right down the hall from George and Sean, so we visit every okay. day, see them in the in the in the dining room, and so I have a great relationship with them. Um, but the, the the vibe is great. You know, I think a lot of young players bringing energy. We got new veteran players bringing energy to the building. I think that that really permeates the entire building. So not just our staff, coaches. You know, George, Sean ownership everybody i think there's a sense of hope and optimism and energy that we feel in the building i'm excited for our fans to actually start to feel that when they come out today and new stadium where are we at there same same as place as we were last time so okay. uh you know all options are on the table you know we've got a lease that ends in 2031 uh this is a generational decision it takes a long time and we'll we'll research and study everything Damani, thank you. Happy opening day. Yeah. Have fun. All right. Appreciate okay. it. You got it. Guys, uh, Damani Leach on opening day of Broncos training camp, the official opening, 10 o'clock. Fans are out here. They got those digital tickets yep. this year. That seems to be working pretty well. All, all organized out here, but uh, there's also going to be a lot of excitement. Back to you.